Hey y'all, it's Michaela. Welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be installing and styling these clip-in hair extensions that were sent to me directly by Irresistible Me Hair. If you guys like how this look turns out, you'll be able to save 10% off your order using my code I am underscore Michaela. So just getting into the actual product, I love that it comes with a test piece in the bottom so you can make sure the color matches your hair before you fully open the package. The hair I chose is 20 inches of extra volume in the color 2. I would say that their colors tend to run a little light. My natural hair is normally a color 4, but this color 2 was honestly still a little bit light for me. This clip-in set comes with 10 different wefts in order to fit the different areas of your head. There is one large weft with 4 clips, 2 wefts with 3 clips, 5 wefts with 2 clips, and 2 wefts with 1 clip. So in order to put these in, I started with my hair up in a ponytail and parted about an inch or two above the nape of my neck. My hair is pretty badly damaged, especially at the back of my head, and I was honestly kind of embarrassed to show it, so I'm going to do my best to verbally explain what I'm doing and show which pieces I'm using for each section. I started using one of the wefts with two clips at the base of my neck. Once I secured that into position, I combed about another inch of hair over the weft and repeated this process going up my head until I got just a little bit above my ears. I'll speed this section up so you guys can see the order I installed these wefts in. all of the clip-ins I wanted installed to the back of my head, I started parting out the front of my hair so I could make the two ponytails I wanted. This ended up being almost like a quarter up rest down type of style. top section into two and then put one side in a ponytail so it would be out of the way. After that, I added a two clip weft to the base of my new section, combed hair over that part, and then added one more two clip weft to this section that I covered with my natural hair at the front and sides so that I could make my first ponytail. Once I got my first section secured in a ponytail, I repeated that same exact process on the other side. I just added in two of the two clip wefts and I put that into a small ponytail.
got my two ponytails done, I went in with my hot comb to try to blend my hair into the extensions a little bit better. I very much have 4C hair, so it can be a challenge for me to get my hair bone straight like the clip-ins. In the end, I felt like you could still see a bit of a texture difference between my hair and the extensions, so I really hope Irresistible Me Hair will consider making like a yakky straight or a blowout textured extension in the future for us 4C girlies. Once I got everything as seamless as I could, I decided I wanted to accessorize, so I used some cute pink clips that I got on Shein for like $5. I put two larger clips at the base of the ponytail, and then I put the flower clips randomly over my hair. This created a really cute Y2K type style and I feel like the accessories also help to cover up the texture difference a little bit. Literally the only thing I can think of that I wish was different about these extensions is the texture since I typically don't get my hair bone straight. I overall thought these clip-in extensions were super quick and easy to put in and there's honestly endless style combinations that you can think of with these. Be sure to check out the Irresistible Me Hair website in the description box below and use my code I am underscore Michaela if you're going to make any purchases. Thank you guys so much for making it all the way to the end of this video. Be sure to give it a like and I will see you all next time. Bye guys!